Hi everyone. In this lecture, we will see how to insert a new record into the table. So we will see what are the available tables in our database. So we don't have any table. So before that, let me quit. Okay, and okay, let me delete all the available files here. So we can create a new database. To create new database, use SQLite 3 and followed by database name and that is my project dot tv okay if you use database okay i have my project dot db let's create a new table that is student table we can create a new table by using create table and the table name that is student followed by parenthesis and inside parenthesis we can give the rows at the field names that is id followed by the data type maybe the data type of id is int and followed by primary key it is necessary to select at least one primary key and also not null which means the id should not be a null and also new field name the data type text and it should not be null followed by h h can be integer and it can be null so we created a simple table and we can see all the available tables by using dot table command so if you see i have only one table that is student so now that we have a table we will try to add some data into the table or we will try to insert few records into the table we can do that by using the command insert so insert into the table name that is student followed by the fields or the rows that is id comma name comma age and followed by values and value should be id and name is ragu age is 30 and we should end every statement with semicolon it is saying no such column ragu okay which means here name is of type text so we should include the text in single quotes okay if you see we already inserted one row we will try to insert few more records and with the name and google so by using this we can insert the records so if you want to see what are the fields available in the table you can use the command select star i have these records along with selecting the complete table we can also choose specific fields like select name comma 
age from table student so it will display only the name and the age and we can also do something like student and we can use the command where id equals to 111 which means select name which is ragu apple google comma age 30 35 55 where id equals to 111 that is this row that ragu 30 so we got the output and as i mentioned in the beginning le lectures we, we will try to format the output by using header okay i turned on the header and also mode that is column Okay, if I'll execute the same command select star from student okay if you see the output previously we got the output followed by the pipe symbol now if you see we got a good header that is name ID and age followed by the data so in the next lecture we will see the basic SQLite operations. Thank you.